Hello there, this is Rom Wills coming back at you with yet another podcast. Don't be low on a woman's priority list. Don't be low on her priority list. What do I mean? Let me go into what I mainly talk about the whole, you know, I'm known for the select, non-select uh, paradigm, which Rom introduced to, uh, which Rom introduced to uh, YouTube. And it was originally introduced to me by Master Yao and Yamache Moore. So I've talked about him several times. Now, here's the thing. A lot of people who've heard that think there's a, uh, you know, the select men are the only ones who get women and the non-select men don't. No, that's not the case. It's more to it than that. It's not, it's not that case. Yes, there are some non-select men who don't get women. Yes, there's plenty. And then... You know, even select men don't get every woman. But there are plenty of non-select men who do get women, even get married. A few might even, like, uh, a few, especially nowadays, might even uh, parent sons, which, uh, let me let me go on a tangent real, real quick with that. The reality is probably less than 50% of men out there will even parent a child. And all of them aren't select. You do get some generally non-select men who parent kids, maybe even get married or something. Where the thing shows up, where the non-select thing shows up, even when a man is in a relationship, is how the woman treats him. She she doesn't treat him well. In fact, she might she might marry him and have sex with him once a month, if at all. You know. She might she might have him as a you know escort to different things publicly, but she might she might walk ahead of him. She might talk to him, talk down to him, might treat him like shit. And see, that goes down to this. If a man is non-select and he's in a relationship, he's not gonna be high on her priority list. Let me say that again. Everything else would be high. Now I'm gonna just say this. If a woman, only time a man should be not number one on a woman's priority list, the only acceptable, and I'm just saying this is acceptable, and even then there's some question about it. Only time it's acceptable is if she already has children. If she already has children and she put her children number one, that's acceptable. But at the same time, there's a lot of men who I can't judge who don't want to deal with single mothers. And the reason why, I, I don't judge. I don't judge them because before I had my sons, I wasn't, I would deal with a single mom, but I wouldn't, I knew I wasn't going to marry one. So I don't judge that. And I know a lot of women get mad at some guys who don't want to deal with single moms, but I can't judge them because when I, the most I would do with a woman is still have sex with her. But I, I, I ain't take her seriously. Now, I'm not, just as an aside, I'm not like that now. But that's because I'm bringing two sons to the equation now. So it's, you know, fair exchange is no robbery. So I'm different now. But let's get back to the whole priority list thing. That's the only time it's acceptable. It's, I'm just, even then, the man needs to be number two. And that's when there's a kid. Now, if she don't have kids, she's single. They do need to be number one. Because you got a situation where a lot of women, they, I mean, because look, let's get back to this select, non-select thing. There's only maybe 30, 30% of the male population who are generally select. So the woman, she, you know, she's going to do stuff on his terms. So they still have to deal with non-select men. But when they do, he's not the main thing. Now, if they single, they, it's like, oh, well, they're going to hang out with their girlfriends. Boom. That's one. That's more of a priority. Or her career. Like, you get a lot of these, like, professional women especially or, you know, high paid. The man is just, he, he's not the priority. They worried about that. They worried about maybe hanging out with their girlfriends, doing all this stuff. Um, you get some cases where it's not necessarily a professional woman, but you get some women who, you know, they'll run and do stuff for that select minister who's probably tapping it on the side. Uh, at that church or whatever spiritual group, and they'll run and do everything for him, but the man, they treat him like crap. Indeed, some men, there's many men just with the church 
There's many men who they don't go to church with their wives or girlfriends. Because and, and the woman, she she put that church and that minister over her own husband or boyfriend. He's on her low on a priority. And it's, it's a bunch of stuff. And it's a lot of women like that. It's a lot of women like that. You know, you get some guys chasing someone. They might get a woman's number, text her, hey, how you doing? Oh, oh, you so lovely. All of that. Give her these long texts, par- several paragraphs. You know, and they'll do that at 8 o'clock in the morning. She'll, uh, and like I said, give it this, like, I don't know, three paragraph text long, several texts, eight o'clock in the morning. And then she'll text back, like four o'clock that afternoon, and just say, oh, that's nice, baby. I'll get back with you later. <laughs> She's low. He's low on her priority list. Look, don't ever accept that. Because if you if you are not if that woman does not treat you like you're number one, like she she makes sure like you text her, she texting you back. In fact, she she even texting you, she texting you initially. She calling you up. She want to spend time with you. You know, she's changing her schedule around for you. Then you hot, but if she ain't, she ain't doing all that or she treating you like an afterthought. Or it's just like, well, we can only deal on these days. You're not high on a priority list. Don't accept it. You're not a selecto. Yeah, you might hit it every now and then, but you're not a priority. And as long as you're not a priority, trust me, trust me, trust me. That means you're not as important. You're just something she's settling for or something. And see, too many guys, too many guys, as long as they get a little something, they good with it. You know, and when I and let me be clear on this, because you do get some side men or something who are below on that priority list, but they know they side men and they know the deal. And they probably got the other women because this is especially guys who want relationships. Let's be real. Most men ain't trying to be players and definitely not maintenance men or side men or anything. Most men want a a nice, strong relationship. And they'll deal with that woman and the woman. I mean, the woman even walking ahead of them. You know, and you get some women, some women will flirt with another man in front of the man. That man's low priority. Don't accept that. Don't accept that. Like I said, the only time is acceptable is if she got children already. And look, I'm, look, you got to deal with it because that's how I am. So <laughs> I'm like, there's a recent young lady I dealt with and she wanted more time. And I was like, Psh, sons come first. That's acceptable. That's acceptable. You know, at least until the child's are 18. Then then I'm gonna tell you what, say you're an older man and she her her kids over the age of uh 18, they can take care of themselves, then you still need to be number one then. That's the only time. But if they got young kids and she gotta take care, okay, that's acceptable. And like I said, the way to beat that, just don't deal with them, man. Let me just say something real quick about that, because I, mean, I get a lot. I know there's a big issue about women, um, women with children wanting a man. Um, Quiet is kept. There's actually a lot of women out there who don't have children, and you know, it's it's scary. It's almost scary to me. I was like, wait a minute. You, you kind of attractive. Yeah, they I, they they piss off when I tell them they kind of. I'd just be messing with them. No, no, but no, they decent. You know, the woman's at least decent, in decent shape, at least decent shape. Don't be having kids and don't be having a man. But then you get some guys all press about the women who got kids. I ain't figured it out. But there's plenty of women out there who don't have children. So, you know, even even that thing is uh, you shouldn't have to worry about the child thing. You shouldn't have to worry about it. It's plenty. Shoot, I get someone who hit me up privately, and it's not even on a romantic thing. They just be like, Ron, what's up? And I'm like, damn, you fine? They don't got kids? What <laughs> for? You know? But whatever the case, whatever the case, y'all, don't, don't accept that. Don't accept it. Yeah, that's select and non-select, but you don't have to accept the treatment. If a woman treats you like she, you non-select to her, leave, it, leave her alone. Just simply leave her alone. Every man, every single man select to somebody. Now, for some men, they, they got a large group of women they select to. Some men got a few groups, like a small group. Right, focus on that small group and just keep going, all right? So anyway, that's all I got for today, y'all. 
We'll talk to y'all later. Peace and blessings.